A New Mexico researcher is being recognized for his work uncovering a new amphibian species from millions of years ago. News 13's Marilyn Upchurch explains how that fossil has ties to our state. Yeah, it was a very big amphibian. Amphibians 300 million years ago were not frogs and salamanders. They were like the top predators. This is Stenocranial boldi, an ancient species found in Germany. It was alive 300 million years ago, which is right at the Pennsylvanian Permian boundary or the, the time periods. Larry Reinhardt, a research associate at the New Mexico Museum of Natural History and Science, worked with researchers in Germany on the discovery and recently published work on the amphibian. Members of the species weighed about 150 pounds and grew to five feet long. It was a carnivore, definitely a carnivore. You can tell that by the teeth. Reinhardt says in the time period it was alive, all of the continents were connected, and Germany and New Mexico weren't far apart. They were on opposite ends of the continent, which was fairly narrow, and across a mountain range from each other. And the... Um, the animals were similar. This is the Eriops found in New Mexico. It's considered to be a close relative of the species found in Germany. The museum says it will be on display sometime this year. Although they differ from their modern day descendants, the Eriopids have similarities. There are holes in the palate that are part of his breathing apparatus. And today, frogs, if you watch a frog breathe, you see this little flutter under his chin. These guys had the same kind of breathing apparatus. Marilyn Upchurch, Care QE, News 13. The museum hopes to get a cast of that German species to display here in New Mexico.